Boom, it's tactical, Carl. This should be breakdown for the Valdi shooting. So, the gunfire is going off. The gunman walks into the school. But before he gets inside of the school, he decides to shoot at the building from the parking lot. This is something that they don't talk about. He's shooting at the school from the parking lot, engaging. You can see him running from the side of the building and enter in a unlocked door. Now check the time, guys, in the left-hand corner. 11.33, Gunman walks in wearing a possible plate carrier and a rifle. Goes inside of the classroom. It's still going. You can see the student right here in the corner. He sees the gunman. Oh, shit. This guy has a gun. This is not good. Takes off running to go alert other people. Law enforcement is on scene within three minutes. Now, do they do what they need to do? Absolutely not. The job is to go to the threat, freaking, you have enough officers, move towards the threat and go do some work. When I say go do some work, I mean go find the enemy that's killing kids and kill him. You'll say, okay, tactical Carl, they don't have enough equipment or gear on them right now. They only have pistols. He's armed with a rifle. Okay, let's just say that. Let's just, for SWAT Jesus, just say that. How long will it take for a rifle to get on scene? How long is it going to be? Is the question. There's active gun fire happening now. Your job, your job is to go towards that gunfire. Your job is to get in that fight. You have to be prepared and ready to die for the individuals that you're protecting. 31 minutes later, 31 minutes later, we have a team ready to go. Pay attention to the guy in the left, left hand behind the shield. He's going to have on a t-shirt and shorts and a hat. You can see him right there, long guns up and ready to rock and roll. That's the father that got the notification of his wife inside of there. And he made sure he was on that stack to go in there and do the Lord's work. But at that moment, I don't think they would have pushed if it was not for him. And what the fuck are you doing getting hand sanitizer? Is your hands too dirty right now, buddy? That, that mm, Now that's the stuff that really makes it frustrating in law enforcement because you know the job and what you have to do. Find the enemy and kill them because they're actively killing innocent kids. And it's very frustrating for a lot of us to watch. This is why training is important, but intestinal fortitude is even more important when it comes to situations like this. Going and getting in that fight immediately. Law enforcement is a really watered down event right now that we're getting away from gunfire. Like on being a more kind, gentler law enforcement. The fact is, you have a weapon on your side, and one day you might have to use it. Be proficient and don't be afraid because other people's lives are counting on you to save them, their children, and their way of life. It's tactical, training to fight, fight like each other. Let's go.